All right, so here we go. We're back on the channel here. Welcome back to the channel. On this video, we're just going to do another test video with the Insta360 camera since we're out here. This is test video number three. Whoa, we got some uh, juice going there. And this time we're just going to ride around here a little bit. We're uh, right now on Beef Bend Road. And we're going to ride around a little bit, testing the camera one more time. On this video, I just wanted to focus a little bit about on this bike here that I'm riding. I'm riding the Lyric Graffiti, and behind me, as you can see there, Keith is riding the Aerial Rider Grizzly. But I wanted to talk a little bit about the uh, graffiti, and you can see it now in action here. And this bike has been my favorite go-to bike since I got it. And we'll see what happens when I get the Graffiti X because I'm probably going to end up riding that a lot. And so this bike may not get as much riding as it was getting. It doesn't mean I'm going to completely park it. But this bike I've had almost a year and a half now. Still riding on the original tires, which is crazy. I do have a new set of tires to go on here, but they're not the tires that are on here. They're not the uh, CST Big Boat. They are, I bought some uh, V Huntsman tires, and I think in order to get them on this bike, I would have to. Uh, take off the uh, fenders because I think the fenders are going to be rubbing against the tire you can't I don't think you can have them on there but I'm debating on whether to just buy another pair of these CST tires because they have done me well and they're only $49 on uh, Lyric Cycles website Want to race? <laughs> but this bike, uh, as I say, what a duck there. It's almost a year and a half. I got it in February of 2023 and and here we are in July of 2024 so And we're heading toward 2,000 miles on the bike. And like I say, still on the original tires. Which is crazy. I wasn't expecting that. Because when I had the Aerial Rider Grizzly, I think I only got 700 miles on the original tires. And then uh, they had to be replaced. And there's V Huntsman's on there right now. So that was not a lot. 700 miles, you can knock that off in no time if you uh, are riding it uh, every day, you know, for any any m amount of mileage at all.
Hello. <clears throat> But uh, I'm really looking forward to uh, getting the Graffiti X and just seeing exactly what the Graffiti X can do. And of course there'll be a race in the future, of course, for sure, with the Graffiti X taking on the Aerial Rider Grizzly. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't wait for that, as Keith just said. Somebody's got to take out the Grizzly. <clears throat> and from what I've seen of the Graffiti X, it looks like it's going to go between, not that speed means everything, but it looks like between 48 and 53 miles an hour, depending on Of course, depending on the uh, weight of the rider, in my case, I'm about 175 pounds. I wanted to turn back there. Oh, well, we'll go this way. Turn here. And, of course, it's going to be dependent on the uh, conditions. And do you have a full charge on your battery to get the maximum speed? Oh. Dog doing his business back there. Volkswagen van for sale. Keith, do you play golf at all? Uh, miniature golf, and I suck. <laughs> we'll just leave it at that. Okay. I'm not a golfer, but if it's pool, you probably uh, know. I'm not good at pool either. That's you, right, the last time we played pool, you beat us all. Yeah, and the only way you guys won is if you cheated, remember? Uh, Joey was cheating. <laughs> all right. Here we go. Oh, power washing. Turn right. Alright, I'm just following. Did the grizzly get a little anxious there? <laughs> <laughs>
I'm curious to see what's going to happen with the Graffiti X when we, if we do a race here, how much you get a lead on me. You know what I mean? Like, how fast is that going to be on the takeoff? <laughs> because I know this thing has great takeoff, right? Yeah. But I I can just tell if it's anything like this bike, which it probably is going to be similar. It's so smooth, this bike, that it just takes a few seconds to get up to speed and then it just it goes. And uh, I, I think this thing's probably going to stay up for maybe maybe 5 to 10 miles an hour. Then after that, it, from what I've seen on those videos, that thing's going to be gone. I think it's a 30 miles an hour easy. Yeah, I know. Like effortless. It's going to be um, the separation. Once we get, once I reel you in, if you get ahead, I think once it gets ahead, you're completely going to be out of the picture. Oh yeah. That's why we have the 360, so we can still see your way back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, that's a good thing. You have to put the camera way up. I know. You can see me way back there. All right. Which way are we going? Straight. I gotta say, I love picking up speed like right there and then just using the regen. Okay. And I have 54.4 volts. I'm at 56. Oh, 54.5. And that's just on one, one battery. battery right? I'm yeah. only running one battery, yeah. Pretty good. Okay. Yeah. Home of the brave right there. Right. Okay. I don't know if this stick went down a little bit or not. Do you remember being that low or did it go I've down just a bit? This time. Oh, okay. Because I wasn't sure. That way it's kind of out of your you know, line <clears> of sight. <throat> Alright, well I can tell you one thing, the black seat is nice and hot. That's the downside of a black seat on the bike, right? They get hotter, but they look really good. Like the black and white on this bike looks awesome. That's why I like the black graffiti. I think that particular bike, the black stands out like from what yeah. I can see. But all the colors are good on the Graffiti X. Right. Uh, I could uh, live with any one of them, but I particularly like the black. I don't know, but that's just me. All right, well, that's going to do it for this video. If you uh, Thank you, Keith, for joining me today. That was fun. And uh, that was test three, so we'll see uh, what what it looks like. So that's going to do it for the video, testing out the new Insta360 camera. That's the X4, the latest one. And if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. And if you would like to subscribe to the channel, just hit that subscribe button. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit the notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to comment, please do leave a comment on the video. Uh, any one of these videos, especially the Insta360 videos, I'd like to see what, what everyone's thinking is on the, on the uh, video quality. And we'll do it all again next time. Thank you, for Keith, for joining us on the video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you later.